Stock footage might get the job done until you've seen the exact same clip used over and over again. But what if you could generate your own branded B-roll instantly inside the same editor you're already using? What's going on everybody? Welcome back to another AI video. Today we're diving into Descript's new generate video feature. It's a game changing tool that lets you turn simple prompts into scroll stopping visuals that you can drop right into your project. Now this feature is for all types of creators and marketers. We're talking fast, polished, on brand content, minus the boring stock footage. Now you can quickly find the link to the script in the pinned comment and description below. Let's jump into things. To get started, let's head on over to Descript.com and let's go ahead and click on get started for free right here. I'm gonna continue with Google. All right, now this is gonna land you on the main interface. Now on the left-hand side, you're gonna see that we're on the homepage. We're gonna have all of our projects right here. And then there is a learn section as well. So I definitely recommend to check this out. So the learn Descript section is gonna have everything in terms of getting started, like how to use Descript script, generating an AI video, which is what we're doing today, and even creating a video with avatars and a bunch of other helpful resources as well. Now I can easily jump into a quick use case by clicking on any of these right here. So maybe I wanna jump into editing a video, creating with an avatar, creating social clips, turning slides into a video. So all the interactions right here is gonna be interacting with the built-in agent called the Underlord. But I'm actually gonna come over to the very top and click on new project right here. So let's click on video project. And this is where we're gonna upload our files. So there's a bunch of supported files. We've got all types of audio, video files, and even image files that we can go ahead and drag and drop. So if you have something like Talking Head A-Roll and you want to go ahead and edit that, I recommend dragging and dropping that right here. We also have the option to paste a video link from YouTube that we can go ahead and edit. And then we can create with AI Speaker, start a recording from scratch. Now I'm starting from scratch. I'm actually going to go ahead and click on Create with AI Speaker right here. So there's a bunch of voices to go through here. I'm going to go ahead and click on Alex and then I'm going to click on choose speaker and this is where we can select an existing avatar but I'm actually going to go ahead and click on create custom avatar right here. I've got a quick little description here. I'm going to select Nano Banana Pro to create this avatar. Let's do it. Okay we've got a few options here. Let's have a look. How about we go with this third one right here. Let's go ahead and click on assign avatar. Okay this is going to open up the project. I've just named it on a hike so I just made a fun little script up that we're going to drop in here it's about a minute long and here is my script now I'm going to click on done writing at the very top this is going to automatically generate the AI speech for our avatar so we are creating the video in real time now of course you could skip these steps altogether if you already have a piece of content that you just want to go ahead and edit it looks like everything is loaded up I'm actually going to go ahead and click on the play button at the very bottom let's go ahead and do that you ever notice how life makes way more sense when you get out here that is sounding great now we're going to sync up the video with the audio so the AI avatar is speaking the script into existence. So here we go. All right, so we are generating the avatar. We're just going to check back in a little bit here. Let's click on continue and we're just going to have a quick listen here. So I'm going to come back to the very top. All week I'm stressing about emails, deadlines, notifications, and then I touch a trail and suddenly none of it matters. Okay, here we go. We just want to make sure we have the timeline visual. So you want to come up here to view and make sure we're seeing the timeline. Line. And now the timeline is going to work in a lot of ways like a traditional video editor. So if I go ahead and drag this up just like this, we see all the different layers here. We've got our audio, we've got the text, we have our footage. We can easily scrub through the timeline just like this. And then on the right hand side, we have all of our tools. And this is where we're going to jump into the best part with this new feature. So let's say that you're editing a talking head video just like we're doing right now. You need B-roll, but everything on stock sites looks overused or slightly off brand. Right, so we're gonna to navigate to a part of the video that we essentially want to add some B-roll. How about this part right here? There's something about climbing a mountain that reminds you how small your problems are. So if I actually go ahead and copy all of this right here, you can see in the timeline, we have all of this selected. And then I'm gonna come on over to AI tools and let's go over to generate a video. We just go ahead and write our prompt. We can attach a file if we'd like to, we can choose a style and we can choose the model parameters as well. So let's have a look at these models. We have a bunch of models here, even the newest heavy hitters one. So VO 3.1, we've got Sora 2. I'm actually gonna click VO 3.1. Let's go ahead and do that. I can choose a style as well, maybe a cinematic style. And we're gonna write in a prompt. So here is my idea, a lone hiker walking up a mountain trail at sunrise 
eyes, slow cinematic camera movement, vast landscape in the background. Let's go ahead and click on generate. Okay, while that's generating, I'm just gonna come on over to my timeline. If I hit control and mouse wheel up and down, I can collapse the length of the timeline, just the scale of it, just so we can see things a little bit better. If I come up here, I can move things up a little bit, just get a better idea of all the different layers. And then here is our tools. I got the select tool. I can easily select a piece and go from there. We've got the hand tool. The blade tool is gonna be for cutting up the different assets. Now I'm just gonna show off this section one more time before we add the B-roll. So I've got my play header right here. Let's click on play. There's something about climbing a mountain that reminds you how small your problems actually are. You take one step, then another, and eventually you're standing somewhere you didn't think you'd get to. Okay, let's have a look at our footage right here. I just got my mouse hovering and we can see the B-roll. This is looking pretty good to me. I'm actually gonna go ahead and click on insert new layer right here. So we have the B-roll right over that section about hiking. So that visual there, and we have a little bit of a crossfade as well. So that's looking pretty good. Let's play this. There's something about climbing a mountain that reminds you how small your problems actually are. Okay, so that's just a nice little spot for that B-roll. Now I'm gonna come over to this section right here where it talks about there being no scorecard, no productivity hack, and I'm gonna copy all of this, okay? And I'm actually gonna click over here to ask the Underlord what we can do. I'm gonna say this, fitting B-roll over this section, no audio. So the Underlord is like the built-in agent, okay? So we're gonna go ahead and punch this in, and right away it's gonna understand the task at hand and come up with an action plan. Okay, so it is adding fitting B-roll over this section just like we went ahead and quoted. So the B-roll is going to be visually relevant, inspirational, and will not include audio. So it's going to ensure the B-roll overlays only this section and does not interfere with the rest of the video. So that is exactly what I'm going for here. Okay, now we just got a short little video right here that matches the part where he says it's just you, your breath, and the reminder that moving forward even slowly is still progress. So let's have a quick listen here. It's just you, your breath, and the reminder that moving forward even slowly is still progress. Okay, so that is all looking and sounding awesome. Let's come over to the right-hand side and click on captions. Let's go ahead and pick some nice captions. Oh, this, this one looks pretty good. All week, I'm stressing about emails, deadlines, notifications. But how about we select this section right here where he says, all week, I'm stressing about emails, deadlines, notifications. Okay, so here we go. We can see a placeholder is getting to work and this is the exact kind of look that I am kind of going for. Let's see the output we get here. Like all week I'm stressing about emails, deadlines, notifications, and then I touch a trail and suddenly I like this whole vibe, but I do want this to be a video. All right, so it's going to change this by inserting video B-roll as opposed to the image we have right now. So those are the kind of changes that you can make on the fly within this editor. Okay, let's come back to our playhead, click right here, and let's continue. You ever notice how life makes way more sense when you get out here? Like all week I'm stressing about emails, deadlines, notifications, and then I touch a trail and suddenly none of it matters. There's something about climbing a mountain that reminds you how small your problems actually are. Okay, that looks awesome. I'm really happy with my generation so far. Now this has done a really good job capturing the overall vibe that I've been wanting to go for, so I'm really happy with that. Now, of course, on top of generating video within the platform, there's a bunch of other tools as well. So we can come over to AI tools right here. We can edit for clarity, remove filler words, remove retakes. We can generate images as well. There's our generate video section. We can even create clips with our longer form content, create highlight reels. There are a ton of settings here. I'm gonna add the eight millimeter frame to everything. Let's add this one. I think this is gonna look pretty good. So it has the eight millimeter overlay effect. Then we go over to our talking head with the digital chaos at work. And then it goes back over to the normal stuff. That looks pretty good. Okay, now I'm super happy with my overall generation so far. So I'm gonna come on over to the very top and click on export. I'm gonna download this. This is also gonna publish the content as well. Okay, so there we go. It is time for some price and final thoughts. Now Descript does have a free version so you can try generate video at zero cost. To do so, just head on over to the link in the description. Now, if you are a beginner or a seasoned creator or marketer, it doesn't matter which level you are and you wanna move faster, stand out visually and stop digging around through stock footage, Descript is the tool that you're gonna to wanna to consider for your workflow. On top of tons of other features, it allows you to generate video that you actually wanna work with. 
with. So with all that, good luck and have fun with your creations.